Welcome to Solutions Studio. This is a free series on C programming language. If you like these videos, please subscribe to follow along with this series. Also, please like and leave a comment and share the video to help spread this series. Hello and welcome to this episode and in this episode we discuss the use of the control variable in the for statements body. You know that in the for loops body programs often show the value of the control variable as I have did in here I have tried to show the value of the control variable by using printf or we can use it in calculations but we do not have to do this because most of the time the control variable is solely used to control iteration without mentioning it in the body of the for statement and this is a good practice. And even though you can change the value of the control variable in the body of a for loop, you should not do it because it can lead to small mistakes. And you should not bring any changes to the control variable inside the for statement's body. For example, I can do something like this, counter plus plus, and this is an additional change that I can bring to the counter even though we have one change in here, I'm having another change. And this is possible if I run the program. You can see that the changes took effect and we skipped some of the numbers. But as we said before this, this is not a good practice and you should only change the counter variable once in your program, once in your for statement and not more than that. I hope this has been informative for you and I would like to see you in the next coming episodes, so stay tuned with me.